The world of military aviation has just witnessed a seismic shift that will redefine the future of aerial combat for decades to come. In an era where unmanned drones and stealth technology dominate discussions about the future of warfare, the U.S. Air Force has made a bold statement. Manned fighter jets are not only here to stay, but are evolving into something far more advanced and versatile. Boeing's recent victory in securing the $20 billion contract to develop the F-47 Victory, the next-generation air dominance fighter, marks a turning point in the history of aerial warfare. This decision not only reaffirms the importance of human pilots in combat, but also introduces a new era of integrated, networked warfare that combines the best of manned and unmanned systems. But how did we get here? And why is the F-47 such a revolutionary aircraft? To understand the significance of this moment, we must delve deeper into the challenges facing modern air forces, the technological advancements driving this new era, and the strategic implications of Boeing's triumph. The context, a shifting battlefield. The debate over the future of aerial combat has been intensifying for years. With the rise of unmanned aerial vehicles, UAVs, and the increasing sophistication of stealth technology, many analysts began to question the relevance of traditional manned fighter jets. Drones with their lower costs and reduced risk to human life seem poised to dominate the skies. Meanwhile, stealth aircraft like the B-21 Raider promise to redefine strategic bombing and reconnaissance missions. However, the U.S. Air Force faced a critical challenge how to maintain air superiority in an increasingly complex and contested environment, particularly in the vast and strategically vital Pacific theater. The Pacific's vast distances, limited infrastructure, and the growing capabilities of potential adversaries demanded a new kind of aircraft, one that could operate over long ranges, adapt to rapidly changing threats, and seamlessly integrate with other systems. This is where the ENGAD program came into play. The Next Generation Air Dominance Initiative was designed to create a fighter that could not only outperform existing aircraft like the F-22 Raptor, but also serve as the centerpiece of a broader, networked combat system. The F-47 Victory is the culmination of this vision. Boeing's comeback, a triumph of innovation and resilience. For Boeing, the F-47 contract represents more than just a financial windfall. It is a testament to the company's resilience and ability to innovate under pressure. In recent years, Boeing has faced significant challenges from the grounding of the 737 MAX to financial struggles and intense competition from rivals like Lockheed Martin and Northrop Grumman. Yet the company's deep expertise in defense aviation and its legacy of producing iconic aircraft such as the F-15 Eagle and F-A-18 Super Hornet positioned it as a strong contender for the NGAT program. The F-47 victory is a reflection of Boeing's commitment to pushing the boundaries of what is possible in aerial combat. By combining cutting-edge technology with a deep understanding of the operational needs of modern air forces, Boeing has created an aircraft that is not just a fighter jet, but a comprehensive combat system. The F-47 victory, a technological marvel. What sets the F-47 apart from its predecessors and competitors is its ability to seamlessly integrate manned and unmanned operations. This dual capability is a game changer, offering unprecedented flexibility and reducing the risk to human pilots in high threat environments. Here are some of the key features that make the F-47 a revolutionary aircraft. Manned and unmanned flexibility. The F-47 can operate with a pilot in the cockpit or autonomously, depending on the mission requirements. This adaptability allows the aircraft to perform a wide range of missions, from high-risk combat operations to long-endurance reconnaissance. Long-range capability. Designed with the Pacific Theater in mind, the F-47 boasts an extended range that reduces the need for frequent aerial refueling. This is critical in a region where distances are vast and access to forward bases may be limited. System of Systems. The F-47 serves as the hub of a networked combat system coordinating and controlling a fleet of collaborative combat aircraft, CCAs. These advanced drones act as force multipliers, conducting missions such as electronic warfare, reconnaissance, and precision strikes under the direction of the F-47. Advanced Stealth and Survivability 
Building on lessons learned from the F-22 and F-35, the F-47 incorporates next-generation stealth technology, making it highly survivable in contested environments. Its design minimizes radar cross-section and infrared signature, ensuring it can penetrate enemy defenses undetected. Artificial intelligence and machine learning. The F-47 leverages AI to enhance its operational capabilities. From real-time threat assessment to mission planning and execution, AI enables the aircraft to make faster, more informed decisions on the battlefield. Strategic implications. Redefining air dominance. The introduction of the F-47 victory has far-reaching implications for the future of aerial combat and global security. Here are some of the key strategic benefits. Pacific theater dominance. The F-47's long-range capabilities and ability to operate in contested environments make it ideally suited for the Pacific theater. Its extended reach ensures that the U.S. can project power across vast distances, even in the face of anti-access area denial, A2-AD strategies employed by potential adversaries. Networked warfare. By serving as the command hub for a fleet of CCAs, the F-47 introduces a new paradigm of networked warfare. This approach enhances situational awareness, operational flexibility, and combat effectiveness, allowing a single F-47 to orchestrate complex missions involving multiple assets. Reduced risk to pilots. The ability to operate autonomously in high-threat environments reduces the risk to human pilots ensuring that the U.S. can sustain operations even in the face of significant losses. Deterrence and strategic advantage. The F-47's advanced capabilities serve as a powerful deterrent to potential adversaries. Its combination of stealth, range, and networked operations ensures that the U.S. maintains a decisive edge in any future conflict. The F-47 designation, a symbol of innovation. The choice of the 47 designation has sparked considerable speculation. Some believe it is a nod to the 47th President of the United States, while others suggest it may reference a milestone year or a significant event in Boeing's history. Regardless of its origins, the F-47 designation adds an element of intrigue to an already revolutionary aircraft, symbolizing the dawn of a new era in aerial combat. Conclusion, a new chapter in aerial warfare. Boeing's F-47 victory is more than just a fighter jet, it is a symbol of innovation, resilience, and strategic foresight. By combining the best of manned and unmanned systems, the F-47 redefines what is possible in aerial combat, ensuring that the U.S. maintains its air dominance in an increasingly complex and contested world. As the F-47 takes to the skies, it heralds a new chapter in the history of military aviation, one where human ingenuity and technological advancement work hand-in-hand hand to secure the future of air power. For Boeing, this victory is a testament to its enduring legacy and its commitment to shaping the future of flight. For the U.S. Air Force, the F-47 represents a critical tool in maintaining global security and deterring potential adversaries. So what do you think? Was Boeing the right choice for the NGAD contract? How do you see the F-47 shaping the future of aerial combat? And what's your theory behind the F-47 designation? Let us know in the comments below.